Here's the story of a lovely lady who was bringing up three very lovely girls. All of them had hair of gold, like their mother, the youngest one in curls. It's the story of a man. Good morning, Afra. I'm Jade. And I'm Melina. It's Friday. Friday, January 25th. Please rise for a moment of silence and a pledge to the flag. Ninth grade students interested in participating in Youth Max should complete the form that was on Schoology and it was messaged to them. So turn it in to the main office. The National German Exam or AG AATG test had to be rescheduled. It will be administered on Monday, January 28th to the students who registered. Level 4 for, for students in German 4 and AP German will be during periods 1 and 2. Level 3 will be during periods 3 and 4 and level 2 will be during periods 6 and 7. Please bring your fully charged laptop and headphones with you to room 207. Field look. Do you have a friend? Yeah. Do you have a friend who needs to be cheered up? How about a favorite teacher? Why not treat yourself because you did something good? Show someone you care by surprising them with a flower. All this week, the junior class has taken orders for single stem carnations and roses to be delivered on February 14th. So place your orders during all lunches. It's this week only. This is the last day to get those in. The Ephra Minithon's Valentine's Day dance is coming up on February 9th. Although the dance this year is not being named Sadie, as girls can still ask guys. Remember, anyone can come, even if you have a date or not. So bring a friend or a date to the Valentine's Day dance in support of childhood cancer. Ticket sales will be held in the cafeteria from February 4th to the 8th for $8 and $10 at the door. Now over to the lovely Derek with the news. Hey there. On this day in history, in 1905, at the Premier Mine in Pretoria, South Africa, a 3,106 carat diamond was discovered during a routine inspection by the mine's superintendent. Weighing 1.33 pounds and christened the Cullinan, it was the largest diamond ever found. Also on this day in history, in 1924, the first Winter Olympics take off in style at, the Kamenek, at Kamenex in the French Alps. Spectators were thrilled by the ski jump and bobsled, as well as 12, 12 other events involving a total of six sports. The International Winter Sports Week, as it was known, was a great success, and in 1928, the IOC officially designated the Winter Games, staged in St. Moritz, Switzerland, as the second Winter Olympics. Now over to Josiah with the lunch. You underestimate my slushy. is up Ephrata. It is Friday the 25th, the first installation of uh, Fiona Fridays, guys. What is up? It is lunchtime, and uh, today we got a Mountaineer cheeseburger, teriyaki chicken with egg roll and rice, buffalo chicken flatbread. Okay, I'm going to be honest, I have no idea where we're looking. Okay, I'm going to be honest, I have no idea where we're looking. PBJ, uncrustable, that's right. I don't know what we're looking. Um, chicken Caesar salad. Steamed broccoli. The 25th. Okay. The 25th. <laughs> Fresh cauliflower and dip. Roasted berry baby carrots. Apple sauce. Fresh fruit. Or slushy. That's a nice fruit drink.
Attention seniors who are planning on participating in NCAA athletes next year. Please pick up a signing day form in the athletic office if you would like to participate on our NCAA Letter of Intent signing ceremony on Thursday, February 7th. Forms will need to be returned to the athletics office by January 30th. Today in sports, boys basketball is away at Warwick. The theme is blackout. Girls basketball is home versus Warwick. And our wrestling team will be at Garden Spot for the Lancaster Lebanon Wrestling Tournament. Now for a special message from Minithon. Monday, January 28th to Wednesday, January 30th, bring in any and all charities. Pennies, nickels, dimes, quarters, you name it, for your home teachers to count. For 50 cents, you can stall them out in your block for one minute. If your homeroom teacher raises, if your homeroom raises a total of $30, you can stall the entire Mountaineer block. Not only do you not have to do Mountaineer activities, but you're raising money for childhood cancer. If you'd rather not participate, be prepared to submit and create a blog about what Minithon means to you. And there's also three other activities which your homeroom teacher will require you to do. So start collecting your change. Look in your sofas, cars, ask your grandma, and bring in your change to cure cancer. You have until you have from Monday, January 28th, until the Mountaineer Block on Wednesday, January 30th, to bring in your change and to give to your homeroom teacher. So support Minithon. Support. Want free Minithon merchandise? All you have to do is follow EHS Minithon Club on social media to have your choice of free Minithon gear. Follow us on Instagram and receive a free colored FTK bracelet of your choice. Follow us on Snapchat for a blue FTK lanyard. Like us on Facebook for a four diamonds keychain. Look out for one of our posters around the school to scan the Snapchat code or get our page usernames. Promotion lasts as long as supplies are available, so act fast. See Ms. Sosie in room 317 to receive your prizes. The Instagram and Snapchat are EHS underscore Minithon and Facebook is EHS Minithon. Juniors, the next, thank you, the next SAT test is March 9th. Sign up by visiting collegeboard.com and clicking on register for the SAT. The deadline to sign up is February 8th, so unless seats fill up first, so don't procrastinate. Have a great day!